The events of today at the Reconus Peninsula are speeding up. We had a cluster of the earthquakes and now we have an increase in the degassing uh, that is release of the gas from the existing fissures. This was the earlier today and then in the evening time we had a sudden increase in the amount of the gases rising from this area as you can see here and uh, uh, this is the K1 to the right and at almost near to the center is the area that we had the previous eruptions um, in the May to June uh, volcanic activity in this uh, area in the source and volcanic system. I will show you a still image of this so you can look at it. This is a still image, the degassing or this uh, uh, feathery you know, gases and vapors rising from the ground. And where the previous eruption was is this within this tri uh, rectangle, you can see it. At the depth when we are looking, we see the earthquakes rising from the depth of the seven kilometers to two kilometers almost. And the area is between the Blue Lagoon and the Grindavik. Blue Lagoon is the famous spot. And Grindavik is a town which has been, you know, evacuated. Uh, during this upheaval of the volcanic activity. The depth that we have now is two kilometers. So this shows the earthquakes are rising in that uh, area and opening the way for the magma. And the center of that is on the Thorbjorn. This is the fault line. The face of the fault line is where actually we will have the magma is possible to move from there. These are the fissures already created. And when they do that, our boreholes at the Swartzengi may feel the increase in pressure and we may visibly see some uh, vapor like what we saw in the previous eruptions and you can see here this was leading to this uh, big bang and eruption of the volcano at that area our defensive walls are holding back against the lava as in the previous eruptions and we are expecting that a similar thing may happen again sudden increase in the gassing may mean things are speeding up for the next eruption uh, the nor one was the name i have given to the area around the fissure which opened earlier and we had eruptions in the previous cases the k1 was the one toward the right